Hello everyone. Greetings of the day. We hope you are keeping safe and sound at home. We request you all to stay home and stay safe. Today, we are entering a buffer area called as the Agarzari buffer. Agarzari and Devada are the buffers adjoining each other and most of the animals swap in between these two areas. The Agarzari buffer has a beautiful lake called as the Irai Lake. So this reservoir is a perennial water source for many animals and also a lot of human population are dependent on this particular water body especially for fishing. As the water body shrinks in the summer we get to see a lot of herbivores which includes the spotted deer the Indian gaur and water birds. So here you can see two spotted deer stags fighting for dominance. This is the time when they rut. They call loudly in order to prove the dominance over the other spotted deers. The winner of the two spotted deers will show off by wearing a crown made out of grass on the antlers. He tries to show off so the other spotted ears who are ready to challenge will have to fight him and then take the females. It's a beautiful evening set up at the Irai water body. We have a couple of water birds. We have a red naped ibis and also a lesser adjutant stock. The lesser adjutant stock has got its name because of the way they walk. These stocks are bald like the vultures 
because they are also often seen scavenging on the rotten carcasses lying on the ground. We can also see a colorful bird called as the Indian roller. There is also a flock of lesser whistling teals, all of them trying to preen and keep themselves clean. And in the background, we could also see a cormorant fishing. Some of the winter migrants have decided to stay back. This is a common sandpiper in the edge of the water body. These birds usually feed on smaller insects around the water body and also sometimes the mollusks. We are now heading to check the other man-made water bodies. We have just spotted a barking deer approaching the water. Usually these deer are solitary and they are often seen in the thickets. Very rarely we see them near the water bodies. These deer are so shy that as soon as they hear the vehicles, they run into the thickets. This female barking deer has made up her mind and is reaching the water body to quench her thirst. She looks extremely scared, yet has decided to drink water with only our vehicle being around. Extremely cautious when they reach the water bodies. The spotted deer and the sambar deer, they raise the tail up, showing the signs of caution.
Finally, she has decided to move. We are now in one of the tigresses called Choti Madhu's territory. We hear the alarm calls of the langur in the background and the sambar is scared. We have spotted this leopard who was walking in the thickets and is right now sitting under a tree. We have spotted a huge bull Indian gore. And also a sounder of wild pigs enjoying their afternoon by taking a dip in the water body nearby the gore. They all look relaxed, having a great time in the water at 44 degrees. From the water body where the wild boars were seen, we are now heading to another area which has a large stream bed. A stream bed which is most of the time cool for the tigers. We are just checking the area in case if there is any signs of a big cat. It is a perfect hide and a habitat for the tigers. The nearest water body from the stream bed is a tiger sitting and enjoying its time. This is a young subadult of a tigress called W female. The summer heat has reached 45 degrees and it's quite warm outside and hence most of the animals try to settle down near the water bodies. 
W female was born to a tigress called Lara and she is the tigress of the first litter and right now she has a litter of two subadults. These subadults are also as bold as the mother. Probably the other subadult is somewhere around. We will see for some more time in case if the other subadult also joins. The tiger is enjoying the afternoon nap. On average these cats can sleep for over 16 hours in a day. Usually the subadults are very playful but as they grow older they start relaxing and enjoying their sleep most of the times. The tiger has made himself very comfortable lying on the back and there is no sign of him waking up. Something in the background has woken up this tiger. It looks very curious to see what it is. He might have heard or seen some other animal. Or it could also be its sibling. He looks extremely curious. In the background you can also hear some alarm calls going on.
and the tiger has decided to follow the alarm calls. We shall now take you leave from this episode from Agarzari and Devada. We will soon come up with another interesting episode for the next week. Till then, stay tuned. Please like, share and also comment on the TATR 4K Live YouTube channel page. Stay home, stay safe, goodbye. Stay home, stay safe. Jai. Sab log apne ghar mein rahiye, safe rahiye. Jai. Stay home and stay safe. Jai Hind. Gari raha, surakshit raha. Jai Hind.